and they're teed off again. You're getting this abundance, baby. You're getting this is yours. It's over. They're mad because you have gotten enlightenment. You're connected to the most high source, whatever it is that you believe, sweetheart. You're connected and you're rooted, grounded, strong. That's what I'm saying. You have a connection with the ethers. You have a connection with the gods, the most high, whatever you believe in. And they're angry. So what I'm picking up, I'm feeling this energy now. This person is like, how come you can work with the deity you want, but I can't work with the deities I want? Hey there, welcome to Reading Journey. I am Journey. Welcome, welcome, welcome. For those of you new, welcome. How you doing? For those of you coming back, welcome back. So glad to have you, sweetheart. Mwah. Those of you new and would like to know, I am clairvoyant, clear sentient, clear audience, meaning I can hear, see, feel energies. I also dream dreams and can interpret as well as have visions. I um, what else do I do? I use the cards as a visual for you. Cards are not needed, but I use them so that I can get the point across and I can share it with you. And you don't think I'm lying and just making up stuff. All right. So what are we doing today? Woo woo. So I'm doing this right now. It is actually the full moon. Very interesting. I did a reading the night before, which was on the 17th. I had gotten a message from God, most high source, she, she, whatever you believe in, doesn't matter to me, doesn't matter what you call it, don't care. Um, but basically to, during this full moon, to gear, gear up, right? Protect yourselves. Um, do what you've been doing because something has closed. A door has closed completely on an individual or some individuals and they're upset about it. So now that they know that you're about to receive what is yours, right? Whomever you are, or you're very, very close to receiving, depending on when you're watching this video, um, they're pissed. So they're very upset. They're angry. They know there's nothing they can do. So they're just trying to put out all the stops because they're just mad. So we're going to take a look and see what's going on because I'm nosy like that. <laughs> hey, I'm not nosy. I'm just curious. Come on. Don't be like that. So let's take a look. Let's see. I'm going to take my time, baby. If it gets too long, sweetheart, just put it in your watch later. Come and watch it later, sweetie P. Okay, sugar butt. Just come on and watch it later. All right. Eventually, I'm going to be doing second halves again so that for those who like to go long, we can go a lot longer. Because I know everybody doesn't and nor have the time. Sometimes energetically, you're just like, yeah, I'm tired. I want to handle more of that. <laughs> and excuse me as I drink my London Fog tea. All right, baby. Sweet Spirit, what is going on here? What is all of this ruckus? Ruckus, ruckus, ruckus. Can you let us know what's happening? What's going on in the background, baby? What's going Okay. I'm feeling really, really good. Okay. I just, I just feel really, really good. I was already feeling good, but then I got your energy, felt even better. Okay, we got the Wheel of Fortune. We've got the Seven of Wands. Yeah, see, something's ended. And somebody still wants to fight. So you've got to defend yourself. I said it could be, listen, some of y'all, this is a group of folks. Or this is somebody using a lot of different entities to try to interfere in your life. But sweetheart, you are on your quest. I heard that earlier because you're already on your quest. You're going to get there. You got to get there. There's just no way around that. Okay. We're just not. in. see, abundance. I knew it. I knew it. God damn it. It's always about some money with these niggas. Excuse my language. It's always about some money with these people. Yeah, because see, you now know. You know how to defend yourself. They can't stand it. You know how to... <laughs> I would be the laugh. I would behave today on this full moon. And Mercury retrograde. That's another thing. They're trying to use the Mercury retrograde energy, Saturn retrograde energy, along with the super full moon. And they just, just, they're just like at it. 
I heard blood moon. Is it a blood moon? I didn't get that. But hey, they know stuff that I don't know. And you know, a lot of times they'll be telling us stuff anyway. But anyway, destiny. Yes, we heard. See, this is just all you. All you, all you, all you. All right. So let's talk about it. You are on your quest, okay? You already got to where you're going. You're still going. You're still going. You found your there's this is coming to a complete, complete close. Cause I know you know, and I know. Cause you're like, yeah, journey is not completely closed because I'm still here and you are still talking to me. Yes, you're right. But in the ether, this is already sealed. And I get the feeling for some of you. These people or person has already gotten a message, already gotten word that this is coming to you. There's no way around it. Like they are trying to come up with every freaking thing imaginable. They have. Everybody's giving up, but there's one still hanging around. There's one that's like, no, it's not over till I say it's over. And they're not in their right, right mind, okay? Let's just talk about it. And they're teed off again you're getting this abundance baby you're getting this is yours it's over <sighs> they're mad because you have gotten enlightenment you're connected to the most high source whatever it is that you believe sweetheart you're connected and you're rooted grounded strong that's what i'm saying you have a connection with the ethers. You have a connection with the gods, the most high, whatever you believe in. And they're angry. So what I'm picking up, I'm feeling this energy now. This person is like, how come you can work with the deity you want, but I can't work with the deities I want? Well, first of all, first of all, You can't take something that's somebody else's. That's where we're wrong at. <laughs> you can't do that. You can't just come and violate somebody's property, somebody's place, somebody's... You can't do that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all feel me. You feel me, Seer. You just can't do that. And you're not... Seer, you're not running around doing anything like that. You're not. And so they're mad because they're like, well, it's just not fair. They get to work with Jay. I should be able to work what I want with. You can, listen, <laughs> listen, I apologize. If my language is off, just follow, just go with the flow. Just go with the flow, okay? <laughs> just go with the flow. Um, again, can't violate somebody else's property. Can't take somebody else's things that are theirs, no matter how you feel about it. You just cannot, okay? We just can't do that. And so they're also mad because, again, your destiny has been met. Somebody was trying to stop you from receiving this abundance. I mean, some of y'all, they've been working with it for years. You didn't know at first, but now you know. You're very awakened to who you are, 7.44 and o'clock. And you would think, They'd have the good sense not to bother you at this point. Because I know, and I've picked it up. Some of you, y'all so good. Woo! Y'all so good. That these folks have been going in your energy and they come back sick. That's why the majority of, that's why these people dropped off. This person's going it alone at this time. They dropped off because every time they try to come after you, they get ill. And I didn't say, we're using the Chakra Wisdom Oracle cards. I'm in rare form today, so please bear with me. I am in my retrograde energy and full moon energy. And Saturn is retrograde. All right. So uh, the old me is, is, is in full fledge right now. <laughs> uh, I ain't gonna lie. I feel it. But we're going to still keep it kind, respectful, okay? We're going to keep it nice. So, doors closed. 
and you will fight. You're not scared to fight them and they know it. Some of you, careful of how much you do do, okay? I would just be quiet about it. Just do what you do. You ain't got to tell these folks what you're doing. You don't. You don't. You can send it through messages through your angels and ancestors delivered, but I directly would not deal with them because right now, any attention from you is good attention. They don't care. They'll take whatever they can take right now. Somebody is not, they're not well. They're not, they're not grounded. They're not at all. They're very upset. Okay. Very upset because you did it and you it's not a thing of you were trying to win or lose it wasn't anything about the about that it was about protecting yourself you had to protect yourself and so someone's upset because you protected yourself and you knew how though i also feel this energy of somebody's very bitter because they didn't realize that they were actually helping you to awaken to who you truly are. So everything that they were doing was absolutely in vain. You better believe it. 10, 33 o'clock, absolutely in vain. And so they're upset about themselves about, <laughs> they're upset with themselves about that because literally they walked you, they walked you right to it. They would have been better off You know, they would have been better off doing like, and they realize it too, though. They realize it too. Like they should have did it a different way. They could have done it silent and easy. I don't know how to explain that. Like the way, all I can say is this, darling, the way they did it made you see it. You had no choice because, because it came at you so hard that you were like, what the hell is going on? Like, it would have been easier to just do little things in your life. But see, for example, I picked these up in some readings over the years where, okay, because they were, because some of these folks, many of them were amateurs, right? And then they finally went and hired somebody. Then they ran out of money. So now they're back at it, going at it alone because they, and they think they know a little bit, which they probably do. They've had enough time to practice on you. <laughs> so they know a little bit and they back at it alone again. So let me back up. I got ahead of myself. So basically what they were doing over the years, someone decided, well, since I don't know where exactly or how or when they're going to get this money, I'm going to attack all their finances. I'm attack all their finances. And if you got children, I'm going to attack their children's finances. If you got a spouse, I'm going to attack the spouse's finances. I'm going to attack everything. Dumb idea. Because what that did was that woke you up to be like, what the hell is going on? Why is my life happening like this? What is happening? What is happening? And that made you dig to find out. You went and looked for answers. And once you got the answers that you needed today, Seer, the new person that you are today is a force to be reckoned with. That nice little innocent person, right? That nice guy who would, you know, everybody's great. Ain't nobody out there doing this kind of stuff. Huh. Not anymore. You since learned like, yo, it's some crazy folks out here. That nice little lady that was always, oh, yes, of course. Oh, my gosh. I'll do that for you. Yes, yes, yes. Now it's like, hell no. <laughs> I ain't doing shit for you. <laughs> like, no. Uh-uh. I know you're tight. You see what I'm saying? So it has built you. It didn't make you. At first it did. Okay? Uh, this might not take pick up where you are, sweetheart. I know people are different on different timelines. I've been following this timeline since 2017. So I'm talking to people who are like right at the end, right at the end. Um, so just pick up where you fit in, okay? 
once they're once they're cycled out, I will do other timelines. Maybe I, if I'm still doing this, to be honest. Um, I don't think I lost my train of thought, but basically, yeah, it awakened you. Oh yeah, I was saying thank you, sweet spirit. You it turned you hard for a little while. It did because you had to go in masculine battle mode, full masculine, whether you're a masculine or not. Masculine, you don't always need to be in your masculine. You need to be balanced in your masculine and your feminine. But my folks, y'all had to literally go hard, hard. And I'm hearing for at least a year. For a year, you really had to go like it was really being slammed on you. You was already having it hard. Some of y'all, it was... Some of y'all, good gosh, some of y'all have things coming from all ends, from not just one family. Some of you, one, two, three families. I've had people. Some people, one family. Some people, two families. Some people, three families. Like, what the hell? <laughs> what is going on? But please believe me, the harder the level it was, the bigger your blessing will be. You better know it, sweetheart. And though, don't get too happy. Because you got a bigger responsibility as well. 33 on the clock. Excuse me. Woo! All right. So let's look into it. Um, yeah, I just want to say, I feel like I need to say this. And I feel like this is coming from your guys, your angels, your ancestors. I'm sorry. Right. We normally don't say, I'm sorry, but I heard that very clearly. They were like, I'm sorry. You had to go through all of this, but you went through it because man, when you see what, when you come out the, on, on the other side, sweetheart, you're going to be so grateful. I'm telling you 16, 16 on a clock. You're going to be so grateful. Mark my words. Two years from now, you'll be like journey. You were right. Not that I need you to say I'm right. I don't need that. I don't want nobody to go through this foolishness. But if it's going to help you grow and do what you got to do, you know, sacrifice one for the millions, that type of thing. I get it. All right, sweetheart, let's take a look. This Wheel of Fortune I want to look at. Yeah. Let's take a look at that, sweet spirit. Let's take a look at the ending why am i singing it like that hold on sweetheart i want to see what deck do i want to use you stay there y'all don't mind me i uh just washed my hair And that's funny because I just washed my hair not that long ago. But anytime the universe will leave me. So some of you may need to wash or your crown, protect your crown. I matter of fact, I just did a reading. It was an angel message though. So I think I'll give it to you too though. You may want to protect your crown. Okay. So maybe wear some hats until oh, through this full moon energy or scarves and protect your crown. Okay. Oil your crown. I'm hearing that as well. And I'm seeing they're showing me like you just taking maybe a, a little dot of lavender and putting that on the soft. You know, when the baby's had a little soft spot in that area of the soft spot area, if you're not sure, just kind of rub it all over your head. Shit. I don't know. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I am getting that. And that was very specific. Matter of fact, I got some lavender right here. I use this brand. I, they, I'm not promoted by them, but I really do like this brand. I've been I've been using this brand for years. Hmm, let me dot mine now. I? <laughs> Just being honest, I think that little soft spot somewhere around here. Okay, y'all like it? <laughs> Just say, hey, hey, baby, baby, communicate. Hmm. I'll take it. So something's been communicated. 
That's why this is over. Ooh. Somebody told on somebody. That's why this is closing. Yep, that's why the six, look how he's handing that to her. Someone told. Someone in the middle, someone's trying to sabotage this. Someone, ooh, someone betrayed somebody here. And it looks like it was a man. So a man betrayed a woman here. It could have been a woman and a masculine energy. Take it as it resonate, but I'm definitely feeling like a man betrayed a woman. Yep, spy. What is this deck? Hold on, baby. Let me see what this is. And someone said, I think it was uh, one of my subscribers. I forgot your name, sweetheart, and I should know it. I just don't, I don't remember off the top of my head. You're welcome. You said, um, thank you for doing these individual signs. You're welcome, sweetheart. That's what I'm being called to go back to. Cosmic oral tarot, tarot is what we're using. So you are very welcome. So those of you who also want your individual signs, just be patient with me. My, my energy has shifted. This energy, this is how you can tell this is coming to a close. Because like I said, I've been following this since 2017 and I have slowed down. I'm doing other things. I've actually gone and I'm, yeah, doing other things. I don't know if y'all saw my little video. I've been making soaps. As a matter of fact, I'm about to go do some more soaps today. Um... But I've been doing that. I've been doing um, getting out and marketing. So I've got a lot of things that I'm doing right now. So a lot of shifting, a lot of good things happening. I hope a lot of good things are happening with you all. I'm in a great, great space. Um, moving around quite a bit. So I'm excited about that. Lots of travel happening. And so you all just... Keep doing what you're doing. Those of you who've been standing with me, standing with me for a while, um, keep going. All right, keep going. Work with faith. I was talking about that the other day too. I actually, I know this might sound weird, but I'm telling you, as you, because we've been elevating, we're changing as a species. Those of you who are awakened and woke and are watching this video. Chances are you are one of them. As we continue to elevate, we're getting more knowledge, more wisdom, wisdom. My gifts are getting heightened even more. I thought I had some gifts. I'm like, they're getting like, it's good though. Um, but I actually, I, listen, I'm just telling you what I'm telling you. I met faith and you're like, what, what faith? Faith is actually an entity. Faith is an energy and an entity. Mm -hmm. Faith introduced herself to me. She is a she. And um, I have been working with faith. So it's been, there's so much going on, you all, in this matrix, in this earth, in this world. So many beautiful, good things that you have not been privy to. Because it keeps you limited. I have been learning symbols, learning how to work and talk with the symbols. The symbols have talked to me. But you have to graduate to get to that level, which we all will. I would encourage you not to push it because I know I guess some people want to do things faster. When you do things faster, you will meet the devil along your path. He's happy to give it to you quickly, but it's always going to go sour. That's for someone. So no shortcuts. Three, three, three on the clock. But I would encourage you, faith is an energy. She is an entity and she will work with you. She's not just a word. It's not just a word. A lot of these words, especially in the English language, are spells. I encourage you to start studying that, learning that, learning about words because they're actually energies. A lot of these things you're saying are energies.
let's see how far this video goes because they be messing with me. They be getting mad at me like, ah, oh, will you stop telling them, Journey? That is not fair. Journey, you're supposed to know your limits on this earth. <laughs> well, I know my limits. I can't tell that. But anyway, work with faith. So someone here has communicated. Somebody has told on another or a group, okay? Or has told specifically on a woman, okay? Um, that's why this has is closing up. This has come to a close, okay? Let's take a look here. What did they tell? Why do I just want to sing that song? What do you do with the Klondike bar? <laughs> just somebody like Klondike bars. What the hell? <laughs> I know. I'm live today, baby. I'm live, baby. <laughs> it's full moon. I thought it's full moon and retrograde got me acting up. And look, I'm like moving my hand off fast because I damn near hit the candle. <laughs> Felt good though, in a way. Okay, stop, Johnny. Excuse me. All right, don't be weird. Okay, let's. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> ah. Ah. All right, let's take a look, sweetheart. What they communicate about. What's communication about, please? Whoa. Hmm. Someone traveling. Someone trying to travel. Hold on, let's see one. Let's go ahead, tell me, clarify that Prince of Wands, please. Ah. Someone. All right, so I got two stories. One is someone trying to convince someone to seduce you. Okay, they told that. They also told that someone... For someone else, someone try to send someone your way to seduce you or both apply. All right. What else do we tell here? Yeah, someone's trying to someone's trying to even convince someone to marry you. To marry you. To balance out something. All right, why? Ten. So they can come out of feeling oppressed. Oppressed from what? I think that was it. Sweet spirit, that was it. Oh, never mind. Yeah, to come out of oppression, to come out of sorrow. Why? Six of cups, so they can have success. So they, so someone told that somebody was trying to send someone after you for success. I'm definitely getting someone was sent to your house directly. Someone's, I'm also getting stolen mail. Someone stole, stole, stole your mail. Stole, stole. You see me going? Stole. stole. I'm cutting. Stole, 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 stole. Okay, stop. Someone stole your mail. Someone to steal mail for someone else for this success. Some type of success. Some type of blessing here. Mm hmm. Yeah, for a new beginning. To stop a transformation here. But you transformed anyway, baby. I love it. I felt that beautifully. Woo! You transformed anyway, baby. Hey. <laughs> I told you, journey acted up today, okay? Don't hang out with me today because 
Journey's acting up. <laughs> Journey acting like she want to go drink. <laughs> I'm not promoting that. I'm not promoting that. I'm serious. Like that old energy, like some things from my past. Look, I'm not condemning anybody that, you know, likes to drink. Baby, let me tell you. Ever since my gifts got so heightened, I cannot. Your girl, your girl cannot. I'm telling you, 4% will have me jacked up. <laughs> I'm not lying. I am not lying. As my children, I used to try to, what was that? Um, Stella Rosa? I don't know if you know what that is. The, the Stella Rosa one? It ain't nothing but a little, like to somebody. They, you know, they, like, they like Journey, really. That will have me jacked up. I cannot. I cannot, y'all. I'm when you are you uh, if you a healer and you know that or you know you're a sensitive or you've gotten more sensitive since that change put in the comments can you even stand to have any drinks at all because i can't i cannot your girl will be toe up from the flow up i cannot it'd be bad i was like yeah so i wouldn't even but that's how this moon and this energy got me feeling like i want to go out and just <laughs> Well, it's not the moon. It's the rec Mercury retrograde. It's interesting. The Mercury retrograde be having me cracking up. They be bringing all kinds of stuff. What is this? Active, lively, feeling good. I know, right? Got me feeling good. This is my energy. So we are not going to take this card because that's what I was talking about when I did it. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that tricks the energy. Yeah, that tricks the energy to be trying to get you. Like, come on. Journey, you know you can have a little sippy sip. I'm like, uh-uh, baby, you won't be, that one will no demons be coming up in here having a party. And some of those, y'all, you have to be careful. Have you noticed? Like, it literally tells you what it is. Wine, beer, spirits. Child, please, don't mess with that mess. They be waiting for you to be zoned out so they can zone on in. Like, nah, you ain't zoning in here, okay? Hell no. Nah. Mm-mm, baby, no. No, child. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Journey's just jibber jabbing at this point. Okay, spy. I want to know more about this spy, please. Journey lie today, baby. Yeah, somebody told. Somebody told. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Somebody, this person could have been somebody like an athlete or athlete in their past. Very good looking, great body or something like that. That's for someone just to let you know you're this. Yeah. Issue. <laughs> okay. I know that's not for everybody, but sometimes the universe will do that, especially for people who are new. Then they really, you know, like, ah, uh, not nah, coincidence. Nope. Not here. We don't do that on this channel. <laughs> All right. Let's see. This person could be, oh, wow. They could have been the person who engineered the whole plan and then they backed out or they were working closely with this person. The two of them were in cahoots. Hmm. Some of you, this person may be an engineer. But what I'm main thing I'm getting is this person engineered the whole thing. And then they turned on them. This person though, they're fun, they, they're, their energy is funny. They like, not funny in the sense of funny, but funny like funny. Because they're the type, they go on, thank you, sweet spirit. They go with the winning team. So if it looked like they were going to win, I'm staying with y'all. If it looked like you're going to lose, I'm leaving. So I really don't trust this energy, even though it looks like, oh, I, they told because they want to help you. Nah, baby. They told because they know they mess up. They would love to hang out with you again, be your friend again couple up with you again, be your brother or sister again, whatever this is. This ain't about 
it's not about that sweetheart it's not it's not about them doing it it's about because number one they mad they're mad at this person or group they were working with They're losing. That's why. And they want to get back at this person too because they also feel like they wasted their time is what I'm getting. And I need to take this, I feel. Exorcist. Hmm. Oh, I'm using the Archetype Cards by Caroline Miss. Hmm. Yeah, oh, see, somebody, listen, somebody was doing a lot of rituals, a lot of rituals. Somebody wants, see, somebody's trying to, I'm getting it. Somebody's trying to heal their karma before they pass on this lifetime. Because this person feels like if they backtrack and do things right, they can get out of whatever they've attached themselves to. Exorcist. This person has got something attached to them or they believe that they do. Or I'm hearing some things. Okay. Mm hmm Excuse me. Someone's been working with deities. And now they want protection. They want angelic protection. And they feel like you have connection with the angels. So they're trying to do good here and you're not talking to them. I need to say this. I feel like I need to say this. You're not talking to this person five, five, five on the clock. And they're wanting that to change. So they think by doing this, you'll come back, baby. You're not coming back. Not this group I'm talking to. Listen, I'm not here to judge you, but I would not. You'd be, hmm, see that old journey want to come out. I would not do that. I'm telling you. Let me tell you why. If you do this, you won't ever see this. This abundance ain't coming because it's not meant to go with this energy. These two energies do not mix. They're not, I'm, I feel that strongly. They will not allow it. They're not going to allow it. Mm -mm. The Most High will not let it happen. Angels, guys, what they believe in is not because this energy does not. They didn't do the work. They need to do the work and then they can be a part of whatever. There's up and trust me, they got opportunities out there for them. There's opportunities there, but they've got to be willing to work with it. They cannot, this energy likes to live off of other people's opportunities because it's scared. It doesn't think it can do it. So they've got to learn for themselves, just like you had to learn, you can do things on your own. You are powerful on your own. You are a powerhouse on your own. You are the I am. You have to, you cannot sit back and wait for somebody else to do it for you or rescue you. You got to stand up for you because again, you are what? The I am. Let's talk. Let's just go with this someone else. I'm going to, um, you may have to break this up. Like I said, some of y'all, I'm going to get more detail in love because I know <sighs> some of y'all got stuff coming from all angles and I'm going to try to hit what I can as best I can. Wherever it stops applying for you, just stop. Okay. And I appreciate you. Ooh, hedonist, huh? Mm. Pursues pleasure to the detriment of health, indulges at the expense of others. My, my, my. It's funny because. Looks like we're getting ready to shift. We're going to shift. I'll tell you in one moment. Okay. Um, so it looks like here.
Somebody was trying to affect somebody's health. For abundance here. Somebody definitely was trying to do something for money. Hurt someone. You. For money. Some of you, you and your children. Just keep it a buck. But you're going to be, you're fine. You already know this though. Whoever I'm talking about, you already know this. If you're new, sweetheart, and you're coming across to me, number one thing with this energy, know who you are. Know who you are. Start learning about spiritual baths. Start understanding spiritual energy and how people use to manipulate. Get yourself educated. You don't have to know everything, but know enough so you know what you're dealing with. Because when you don't know what you're dealing with, that's where we fall short and crap happens. But when you know what you're dealing with and then know how to gird yourself and protect. And eventually it'll fall off just like these are. All right, so we're about to switch off, okay? So this is what we're doing. I feel an energy that I'm finna hit now that is for people who you're dealing with an ex who has a crazy ex because that ex is headed back your way. Whether you know it or not, 44 on the clock, that ex is headed back your way at some point, and this ex of theirs knows it. They just don't know when. They think they're already there with you. Okay? So we're going to go ahead and skip on into that. For those of you who have been following me so far, appreciate you. Take care, sweetheart. Please be careful of those you allow in your energy. Please do not let everybody in your energy, especially today, because there's a lot of craziness going on right now. So I do appreciate you. Thank you for allowing me even in your energy. All right. That being said, if you want to know more about me, who I'm tapping into, what I'm doing, there's a link in the description box below that will take you to my website. I'm not open for personal readings that now, right now, but you can take a look at that. Tells you how I got started, who I'm to, talking to, because hell, you might not agree. You might be like, that. just crazy. I okay, so let's get into it. All right, so let's get into this love half. For those of you got the crazy ex. Well, this crazy ex was definitely trying to do something to you. Your uh, ex's ex. This man or woman may have been married to this person. Definitely fine. Feminine energy. Yeah, something was exposed here. Your ex found out something about this person and it broke their heart. All right, let's talk about it. I feel like they've gone back to that person several times. But manipulation of energy and magic was used because this woman, I definitely feel a woman, was trying to block you. Could be a man too, but take it to resonate. Trying to block you trying to keep you from getting money because this person is very successful at what they do and they make good money. They could have some Taurus in their, I don't know, career or something or Capricorn. It could be a very hard worker. And this person did not want you to get this person because they knew what they were doing to keep that person from you. They were manipulating energy. I'm hearing their mama, so their mother was helping them do it as well. They may come off as church people. They're not. They're little trifling little hoes. That's what they are. <laughs> Sorry. I told y'all I was acting. <laughs> They're not hoes, oh, sweet spirit. Mm. Set that out the atmosphere. They were acting like it, though. Okay? All right. Let's take a look at these chicala, chicala, chicas. Acting up. Acting up, acting up, acting up, acting up. I'm hearing a song. Some people have to have it. Hey, hey, hey. It's not funny. It's not funny. Twice I've seen the judgment card come up. Yep. So some judgment about the judgments on their heads, baby. Judgments on the heads. 
baby. Because something is balancing out. This person left anyway. You left any damn way. Like, what? If you got to do all of that, yeah, see, they left anyway. And now they're brokenhearted. The ex is, oh, the ex is upset. And they're trying to get this person back. They've been sending them. They've been trying to get go to them, find them. They don't know where they're at. They could be hacking this person's like devices, information, bank accounts. What up? Listen, ain't nobody stuff that good. Four, 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 four on the clock for me to be trying to go to jail. There's plenty of dangling, dangling, dangling out there, and there's plenty of the poo poos, pu -pu 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 out there. Stop it, Jesus. These are grown. The, listen, it gets me upset because these are grown people. These are not kids, man. Hmm. So they keep trying to text them, call them, and this person's ignoring them because they just want to fight. They always fighting. This person has left. Look, this person's taking the King of Wands energy regardless of their sign. They are gone. They gone. They said bye bye. I'm not dealing with you no more. You too cuckoo but they really did a oh, uh, they did a number on this person they really did they really did a number on this person tell me more about what's going on with this person here tell me what's going on with this uh king of wands energy person they're not going back i keep hearing it they're not going back they're not going back why are they not going back hold on I switched already. Why are they not going back? Ooh, that's a hopper. Guardian. See, even the most high, they're protecting them. The angels are like, no, sweetheart. Again, more judgment energy. You cannot. So something is etched in stone where this person's not, they're not going back ever. They're not, they can't go back. Yeah, because they're dealing with a narcissist. This person's narcissist. I also feel like, yep. Yeah, Look at this shit. Love spell. I'm telling you, love spells. Spells were done. Spells were done. Spells were done to keep this person from moving. They probably, I believe they even did a spell for this person to do gambling, to be addicted to gambling. Cause they knew their past. Man, that's just crazy. I just, I don't know. Tell me more about the King of Wands energy of Sweet Spirit because I'm getting frustrated. I can feel the energy of this person, the, the King of Wands that left. Tell me more about the King of Wands, please. Yeah. Tell me about the King of Wands energy, please. Good doing. King of Wands is in the Empress energy. Beautiful. They're in an Empress energy here. You could be dealing a Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. It could be any sign though, okay? But that stuck out to me. Tell me more about this person. Okay. Two of swords. Let me just get a clarifier on that. Clarify that for me. Hmm. Three of swords. So they're ready for, they're ready to release something. They're not sure how you're going to take it, though. This person wants to tell you something. They've been in their head about this, okay? They don't know how you're going to take it because they know they disappointed you. They know they involved somebody in, a third party in. Five of Swords. Mm. They know they were in their ego when they, at least they feel this way. I like this though. Let me tell you why. I like this maturity because they're like before, I feel like this person was using the excuse of, well, they were doing spells on me. But now that at a point where they did spells on me, but still I had free will. I made my own choice. I still made a choice to go the wrong direction because this person had, I'm hearing there was a bunch of red flags that they did not pay attention to. So I like that maturity. They're not trying to um uh, deny no, that you're not trying to deny it anymore they're being very i like this i like this this might be all right if they come back i mean it's totally up to you 
If you don't, I get it. If you don't take this person back, I get it. Page of Cups is here, though. Mm, what a fish in a cup. I don't know how I feel about that, sweetie pea. I don't know how I feel about that. Give me a second. I don't know if I trust the fish in the cup. Hmm. Let's see. Clear about that fish in the cup, please. Mm. Ten of Cups. I like that, though. But I also see the Ten of Swords at the bottom. The Sun card. That's not the... And I need to take this, too. Take a look, take a look, take a look, take a look. Okay, so what I'm getting here is here... Okay, they want to offer you something. But they're not, I don't think they're quite ready yet. I'm here quite cooked. Or they're seeing it as I don't have much to offer. What I have to offer, okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. They might be all right, y'all. They might be all right. But you use your intuition. Some of y'all, I know you're going off. I ain't taking that the back. I know you don't have to, lovely. So I feel with this, though, they're admitting I don't have much to offer. What I have to offer you right now, it ain't much of nothing. It's some bullshit, right? Because I feel like they're going through a current divorce or separation of finances with somebody. I'm definitely here in a home. There's a battle between a home. But they want the Ten of Cups with you. They do want the Ten of Cups. You make them happy. They feel balanced when they're with you. They want to give you the world. They want to give you the world here. But. Hold on here. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Let me, give me a second. Let me clarify that. Ten of swords, please. It could be, though. Hold on. Ah, high priestess. Okay. This one's got me a little bit, Sierra. I ain't gonna lie. There's a feeling of like they're afraid they're gonna fail you, though. This person sees you as the high priestess, very knowledgeable, very psychic, very intuitive very balanced, very connected with the divine. And they're afraid that they're going to fail you, but they still want to try. They also feel like they did fail you, but they're trying to fight back. Something they're doing. I don't know if they're, it's secret I'm hearing. I don't know what they're doing, though. It's not bad against you. It could put them at risk at something. I don't know what they're doing. I'm hearing outlaw. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, please don't. We ask that nobody gets, you know, physically hurt or arrested or some foolishness. Because I can feel like this person is like your person got a side to them like if you mess with them like there's a side of them that will come out 
I think we all have that. I think we all have that a certain part of us. Well, no, I won't say we all. I mean, I think we do. We do because we have that light and dark in us. But if it goes too dark, it ain't good. And I feel like this person, like, they feel, oh, man, I feel that. This person feels like their life was destroyed because of this person. Like they destroyed something beautiful that they could have had with you. And they're mad about it. So just, I would put up a, a prayer request for this person that they don't go too far. Help them to stay balanced. Because I really, I want to cry. This person has a lot of love for you. A lot. A lot. They feel like they lost. And they'll never get you back. They don't know where you are. I'm getting that as well. They like, I don't know where they are. Or perhaps, yeah, that's what I'm getting. They don't know how to get back to you. Or, or they just don't know how to get back to you, like in your good graces, but they want to try. They do want to try. They really, really want to try. Damn. Yeah. See, they've got their sights set on going forward. They've left some things in the past. Someone could have left an, a, a, a mother, mother figure or father. This like, yeah, there's something with those two wands in the background. I feel like those were important to them at one time and they're, they can't anymore. I feel this energy like I can't, I cannot, I can't anymore. I can't. Because they've seen something. They've seen something they can't go back from. And they know God is pointing them. Look at this. Wow. Ace of swords and wow. Ace of wands, sword and sun card. They're not going, I'm telling you, they're not, yeah, look at the chariot. I knew, I felt that. They're not going back. They can't. And they know God, somebody here has really been talking to God. They, I'm saying God because this is how they refer to them, to that energy. And they're pissed. Wow. This person's in like warrior mode. Like they are on a mission to get back what was taken. They really are. I can definitely feel like, yeah, because they're, my second chakra is very tight. My, in that, my heart chakra. And you still heard the hot, heavy side just did. This person has definitely left a lot. They've gone through a lot, a lot, a lot. And they're mad. I'm hearing it. I'm mad. They're mad because they really shouldn't have, they should have held on to their finances and not given it to this situation. They may have even built a business with this person, family with this person. They have regrets. Yeah, they never, they should have. Yeah, they feel like they should have put this shit to an end. Day one, they were like, there was flags. There were red flags, but they were too busy looking at this coin. Too busy looking at this coin. They thought this was going to be wish fulfillment, which ended up being a nightmare. But now they feel like, yeah, I'm a little too late. They feel like it's too late. Like they should have not looked at, at that because they knew it was too good to be true. But they kept listening to everybody else. And I keep hearing mother, mother, mother. The mother kept telling, this is what you want. Isn't this what you want? You want a family? You want grand? I want grandkids and blah, 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 blah. And see, he was giving a lot to this situation. He or she was given a lot to this situation. There's a lot of masculine energy here. This person was given a lot to this situation to the point where they got themselves sick. To the point where they got themselves addicted and now only finding themselves to be left in a cold. And you over here looking fine. Fine as ever. Okay. Having a whole new beginning in your life. And they're burdened. They're burdened and stuck. 
burden is stuck. That's so sad. But it's not sad for them because they're, look at the angel is right there along with the Ace of Cups. Once they come out of that and, and see that, I feel like this person is just about there. Look at, they're literally going in the order of the angels are protecting them. The Ace of Cups comes through and then there's a Fool card. They're literally about to start a new beginning. And it's actually going to be quite quick. Yeah, quite quickly. The devil card, quite quickly. It's going to move quite quickly. And I feel like once they get out, again, once they get out of that, once they take their mind off of that, because I feel like the devil's just playing with their mind right now. And they're just learning. Honestly, I don't even feel any de devil energy. I feel like they're gone. The only devil energy is them being obsessed and going towards what it is they want, which is not bad. That's not a bad energy to be in. They're back balanced. But my concern, though, is things could go sour um, because if this person keeps messing with them, because I definitely feel like somebody, this person is hacking their accounts. They're not. They're, they're hacking their accounts or paying someone to hack this person's accounts just to make their life. This person is doing things to make their life a living hell. So just put up a request for this person. You're just doing it to just make their life a living hell at this point. Because they're mad. They're angry. They're mad. They're frustrated. Oh, and I want to see you because they're coming at you. So what's going on with my seers? What do they need to see, sweet spirit? Oops. How the seers all fit into this? Here's something about girls. I don't know what's going on with that girl's thing. What's going on with the seer, sweet spirit? What do you want them to see? What do they need to be aware of with the situation? Hmm. Your heart, you attract more love. Hmm. So this person, again, is coming towards you. I'm definitely hearing from the universe, open, open up your heart. At least listen to what this person has to say. Now, you don't listen, baby. You do what you feel is best for you. <laughs> okay? This reading is not for everybody. Because you might not, you might tell them go to, okay? But you'll know, trust your gut. But this person definitely is coming towards you. And this is what that other person is worried about, their ex, because they're opening up their heart to you. They're about to tell you the truth. You could be dealing with a water sign, Cancer's Pisces, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, Air sign, Gemini Libra Aquarius. Yeah, see, this person is worried because they know this, this person was going to go back to you at some point. And they're, they're hell of impressed by your patience. Can't believe that you waited this long. But it wasn't that. You were not waiting on this person. You were doing what you needed to do. The universe had you waiting. Okay? If you're still single. And this person, yeah. They know that they're cycling back to you. You could, this, their ex could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn person. And they know, yeah, they've been lying. They've been lying. They've been lying. And you knew you could have said this to them. You did something. Something this person you may have said. Or knew, I, somehow this person knew you knew this or you said this to them, 3, 3, 3 o'clock. Give it time. Or they knew the universe, God was speaking to you about the situation. Give it time because this person's going to leave. And they did. And now what's happening? Divorce. And this person's frustrated because they knew they were coming back to you. You could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or that person. Could be an Aries Leo. Somebody is a fire sign here. I feel like it's either you 
or that person, the ex. And they could be coming back this Mercury retrograde. But this person keeps saying, no, no, it's not the right time. No. And it's funny because the person they've been dealing with, they're by. And I feel like that's what one of your, um, your ex found out. This person was by, And this person may even have some type of STI or something going on. There's something going on with this person's health. I'm also getting your exit, your ex, their health was affected. This person may have done something to affect their health. Child, that's just too much going on. I feel like I need to take this. Yep, Ace of Wands. Listen, so at the end of the day, this person's leaving. They've already left that person. They're headed back your way. They're headed back your way because they're getting signs from the universe. This person may have not been able to sleep for a long time. They haven't been well, I'm hearing. They haven't been able to sleep. They've been working a lot, just working, working, working to try to, ah, that feels sad, to try to keep their mind off of you and off of what is going on. Yeah, Tower. This person's had it hard. Hard. But it had to go that way for this to balance out and for them to get moving. Yeah, again, to get moving. The three of wands and the eight of uh eight of cups to keep to get moving and stop investing in this. Four of Pentacles and the lovers card. Stop investing in this because it's not healthy. Because all this person wanted was money. That's all they ever wanted. The mother, this has something to do with their mother, mother-in-law. And some other folks from their family. This person has been dealing with a lot of drama. A lot of unnecessary drama. But it's ended now. But they still hurt. They're hurt because they're still healing. They are still healing. Okay. But the majority of it, they're over. The hardest part was them to be able to admit to themselves that their family's garbage. And they have to walk away. This connection was garbage. It's sad. But on a good note, they're out. They're out. So what I see again, I see them coming towards you. I see this coming. I, I'm hearing happy new beginning. The world card, this is over. This cycle is complete. You both have something to learn here. This could be a twin of yours. Um, if it's not, I'm not diagnosing that today. You would already know. But it's going to begin again. Okay? This car is calling me. Yep, pregnancy. This is beginning again. Maybe you will have children with this person. Maybe you will. Some of you, this person could have found out that that person they were dealing with got pregnant by somebody else as well. But the main thing I'm getting, new beginning. New beginning. Yep, Hierophant. New beginning. It's written in the stars. So I'm hearing it has to happen. Okay. All right. Well, then it got to happen then. All right. Well, thank you so much. I know this was super long, super, super long, but I appreciate you. And hopefully I will see you next time. Peace, health, and harmony to you. Take care, darling. Bye-bye.